So Juice Rose final album, the party of her ends is finally dropping this Friday as you got new singles, the album cover which has gotten a lot of mixed reviews from fans, a Fortnite skin collab, and a bunch of other info for the album. But let's take a look at what we as fans know about the party never ends, the confirmed songs and what we can expect next ahead of the 29th. And our first of all, looking at the cover that actually was teased, I believe when the Juice skin was first announced, if I'm like not wrong. And now right off the bat, bro, I thought this cover was an absolute troll, bro, not gonna lie. Because we already got a different version of this cover from Bibby like last year, which looked way better. But then I watched the trailer, which like, you know, low-key made me feel old because one day shit, I'll be a fucking unk telling my kids stories about Juice ex Trippy. But anyways, the cover was then shown in the trailer, which actually made it official. And now right off the bat, bro, I'm sorry. If you put this cover beside all of Juice's prior covers, it looks so out of place. Because Juice has some iconic ass covers like Legends Never Die, Death Race for Love, and especially Goodbye and Good Riddance. And I obviously know the Party Never Ends cover is designed by Murakami, which is an obvious legend. And Juice did work with Murakami in Japan prior to his, like, you know, passing. So I guess it somewhat follows Juice's vision. Hey man, I would have much rather had the V1 cover for the Party Never Ends. I hate to be that guy hating on the, on the like, you know, cover, but hey man, that shit is not it, bro. But hey, obviously we are getting new music and that's all that really matters yeah man it's all good though because everything else besides the cover is like you know pretty solid obviously we actually did get new singles like all girls are the same part two with Nicki minaj which probably has the most beautiful juice first that i've ever heard man man that dude was actually talented a single was supposed to drop yesterday which it didn't but we did get another grill for many juice fans that being arctic tundra with Nicki minaj but looking at other info regarding confirmed songs so far is obviously all girls are the same two aka insecure and empty out your pocket which actually is supposed to premiere alongside the Fortnite collab, I believe, like next week. And during the small party never ends uh, event hosted by PNLA, a bunch of songs and grills in particular were played, like songs like KTM Drip, Pills in the Regal. Hopefully, these songs do drop, bro, because I'm fucking tired of, like, you know, opening SoundCloud to fucking play these goddamn leaks, bro. And according to Season, apparently, hey man, Rental is not dropping, which actually sucks because, like, you know, they've pulled it off on dropping that song for, like, the longest time. If it's not dropping, then the like you know sample probably hasn't like been cleared or something but hey man other news is how there's apparently a grade 8 album in december which i assume uh has juice i mean i don't see why it like won't have juice on it bro and another juice world documentary too which hey man that shit sounds absolutely fucking fire because we know how much juice footage is left by like chris long films for example and looking at the promotion and the hype man it's pretty damn big right now apparently p and baby are gonna get streamers like freaking phase and you know kai Nat to actually promote this album Album. and obviously the fortnite collab which is launching on november 30th with the new skin which actually like you know looks pretty damn good a back bling and emo which the emotes fucking epic games absolutely cooked and they even got juice in the map bro that is so fire and i'm pretty sure epic is also working on bringing x into fortnite as well and obviously a x and juice song was teased like back in august maybe they might incorporate that into the fortnite collab i don't even play fortnite man like it's like been like two years since i fucking you know opened the game but shit i look he might have to squat out for the og fortnite and the freaking juice skin bro and off topic but juice had the biggest streaming day yesterday with 19 million streams in a single day that is actually fucking mad probably because he's being talked about like everywhere right now and the hype is definitely like you know real for sure i probably see it being sold like 120 to 150k sales but i don't care about these sales because we are because we are getting one final juice album which is low-key sad because we know how much music he actually has in the like you know freaking vault right but all good things come to an end and and hey man, hopefully, hopefully Grade A cooked with this album. Comment down below what songs do y'all want to see on the album. It's been a Ram channel. Love y'all guys. We out.